it's Rebecca from RebeccaAdamsBiz.com and this video is about frequencies and how you can get from the negative to the positive if something's annoyed you straight away, either first thing in the morning or whenever actually. And the thing is about frequencies, the, the universe kind of aligns with you on what your frequency is. So cut long so short, if you wake up in a bad mood, everything will carry on from there because you've got yourself in a bad mood straight away, you've woken up on the wrong side of the bed as some people say, you've stubbed your toe, done something, whatever, something's annoyed you, it's raining outside and everything else. Um, so therefore, uh, I mean, I've just sat on, just sat looking at my phone, scrolling through a social platform, social network platform, and um, yeah, people are people are moaning about things and that, and it's like, oh, and there's like angry faces on there and on the emoji things and stuff, and I'm like, seriously, how on earth? Because I wake up very, very rare to wake up in a bad mood, um, and I get myself straight away. I do my gratitude challenge. I read, I'll show you, I read my, I have this, um, the secret daily teachings, I read this every single morning and I get my head in the right frame of mind and I send out there my frequency of kindness, love, joy, peace, gratitude um, and everything that aligns with that, that's the frequency I'm on, it's like, um, you know, changing the channel. So say, for example, you're on one channel and you want to change a channel. When I grew up, and probably probably a, some of you guys as well, you had to get up and change your channel. Now everyone's got remote, haven't they? So, um, but anyway, so when you change the channel, it's just like that. You're changing from the negative to the positive or whatever. It's entirely up to you. And something will go on on that channel. So say, for example, halfway through the day, something goes wrong. Um, and then for the rest of the day then, it um everything just carries on going wrong and it just kind of you're then on that frequency and all you have to do is change the frequency and some people don't get it they carry on ranting they go i mean i'm not saying i don't rant i do but as soon as i acknowledge it and I, it kind of it's taken me a while but as soon as i acknowledge it and i'm like no bets i need to actually change my head and i always work on mindset with everyone and everything work on your head change the frequency of what you're on that's what you're sending out and life is like life is like a train journey as i said but whatever frequency you're on whatever you're sending out there it's like a boomerang it's going to come back to you and i do say to my daughter you know whatever you're sending out into the world comes back to you so if you want kindness to yourself send out kindness doesn't matter how nasty that person is to you send out kindness that doesn't mean that you can't stand up for yourself but you've still got to be mindful about what you say but talk about frequencies and changing channels from positive to negative. As I said, I've just been on a social network platform. I won't tell you which one, but you'll probably know that scrolling through and having a look and everyone's moaning and whinging about stuff that started a bad day and it's going to go worse from here. Well, yeah, it is now because you've asked for it. That's what you've sent out there. You need to change your channel. You need to change the frequency that your head's on, that you're aligned with. And um, if something goes wrong or you get a bill through the door or a horrible phone call or something, you know what? Then you need to take a step back, turn everything off, and just either visualize, meditate, sit there silently, whatever you want to do, and kind of change your head um, and get it onto the frequency that you want. You've got to be comfortable with whatever it is. If it's kind of one person this morning, her her son broke the toy or did something or smashed something up or whatever. It's like, right, okay, I know you're angry. Not good. It's not a good situation at all. But then you start overthinking, you know, about, oh, that needs replacing. It's going to cost money. Rah, rah, rah. Then it goes into, I've got no money. Then it starts. And as soon as the husband, boyfriend, partner, whoever gets home, then it starts again, a ripple effect. And it just goes on and on and on. And there's only you. You can't control everything, but there's only you that can control what goes on in here. Your mindset, thoughts become things. You have to control your head and your thoughts, okay? And the best way of doing that is acknowledging straight away what's going on, that you're going off on one, you're having an argument or you're moaning about something, <coughs> excuse me. And um, yeah, to basically get off that frequency and to turn it into, right, okay, he's damaged it. Nothing I can do, I can't control it. I can only control my reaction 
to the action or whatever's been said or done or whatever. And then we'll have to move on from there. Because you cannot, I'm telling you now, you cannot in life carry on with this negative mini thing all the way through. You know, you can't get a positive without a negative. You need bad health to appreciate good health. You need to, you know, miss the bus so you appreciate when it's on time. You know, that kind of, that kind of thing. Um, and it comes in the scales. You need both to balance and it that's okay. But, you know, that doesn't mean you wake down all the negative side all the time when you're positive so you a little bit, you know. It kind of, you've got to switch for, switch frequency and get your head in the right mindset and the right frame of mind and see the joy and kindness and love in everything and to send out there again all the happiness and joy because that's going to come back to you so if you would like to comment below and let me know your thoughts on changing frequency or changing the tv channel or whatever let me know what you're thinking is it easy for you to do can you, as soon as something negative goes on, are you off on one for an hour and then you're fine for the rest of the day? Or does it, is it kind of gotten to a routine that it just carries on for the rest of the day and then everything goes wrong? It's basically you started rolling that ball down the hill and it's just going to carry on going. Let me know your thoughts. Comment below or pop over to Facebook and let me know. If you um, like this video and think it can help someone, please share it with your friends and please subscribe to my channel. I will be truly honoured. Um, videos come out every, every week. So different topics and everything else to help as many people as possible. And um, yeah, just let me know how you're getting on with the frequency. Sometimes it does take a little bit of time to change the frequency a little bit, like changing channel. But um, once you acknowledge it and you appreciate how good you're going to get good at doing it, um, you'll be more at peace with yourself and then you'll align with everything that you want within your life and it'll come back to you. So I will see you soon. Take care.